Mick, thanks for joining us. Head of uh, Clash with one of the inform teams, but we're certainly in decent nick ourselves at the moment. One of the other inform yeah. teams. They are, they played really well. Three games on the bounce, they've won. And good performances we've seen. I'm seeing them all on the uh, on Pro Zone. Uh, got, they've had good reports about them. Golf scoring James Vaughan as well, which always helps. Yeah, yeah, he's a, he's a real handful. And because let's hope they talk about Celtic upsets him now, because that's, <laughs> that's they've already started those rumours. Well, they're not rumours anymore. It's it's in the public domain. And uh, Mike Robbins is after having to answer questions about it. He's a good player. He's a real handful. He is. Uh, how do you handle that as a manager when one of your players is sort of been been sought by other clubs and it's it's out there that they want him? Uh, I take it as a compliment first and foremost because he must be playing well. Secondly, I speak to the player and explain to him that he's he's not going to be going, and no matter what anybody's getting in his ear all and any other stirring behind because mm. it happens. Uh, and also explain to him that if you know everybody has a price really, and that somebody comes in and makes a bonkers bid for somebody, it, it gets so you can't help it. So. I, I try and get them to understand the rationale behind it all. Mm. That you're not just going to leave. We're not going to leave for you, let you leave for peanuts. But if somebody does come in and ask, ask, offer, not the asking price, but something that we feel you can't turn, that's at any club, not just here. I'm not talking about Ipswich.